Righty ho, welcome back to uh, Return of the Nerds little uh, action figure pad. This is where I live amongst the Hasbro boxes and the rats and the cockroaches. So, this is an update for all you G.I. Joe lunatics. Everything in this video will be talking about classified, alright? Um, so, we've got all the range vipers, as I promised, we got them restocked. Let me just touch this for you in a very seductive way. Uh, I've got a question. Why Why do they give them such uh, like feminine names like Potter? Harry Potter. This one's even worse. Come over here like Snow Job and then the, the code is Joyce. That's a woman's name from the Victorian period. This guy should be called Casey fucking Ryback or something like Wellard. Ryback's tactics. Ryback. That's what it says, Ryback. Casey fucking Ryback. I'm wearing this today out of respect for Big Bollocks Ben, all right? And the, and the SAS. Can we have some like decent code names, please, Hasbro? It's insulting. Anyway, back to the topic in hand. We've got Range Vipers over here. In the center, we've got Big Bad Ben from the SAS. And uh, Arctic Bat. Over here we've got tons and 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 tons snow jobs, all right? And if I sell out of all of this, which I probably will again, tomorrow is first day. First day we get our wholesalers list, which tells us what's in stock, what's in the warehouse. So if I find out that we still have yet more, then I'm just going to eat them up like Pac-Man, okay? Um... Right, listen up. <coughs> Yesterday, <coughs> I wrote a newsletter and I sent it out to everybody on Gmail, all my uh, clients. I put it on my Facebook page, in my group. I put it on Instagram and my community tab. So that should answer pretty much everyone's questions. Now, if you're one of those individuals that's lazy, that cannot be bothered to read stuff that I post on social media, then you're gonna start to piss me off, right? Because if you start asking me questions that I've already explained on social media, what's the point in me making these videos? All right? Don't make me lose my shit. So I'm gonna say this for the last time and the last time only. <clears throat> August, in two weeks, very soon. August the 15th, we are getting snow serpents Crimson Alley Vipers and Tunnel Rats. I shall not say that again. Then, uh, followed up very quickly by, uh, this is September the 1st, okay? The Cobra Eels, Cobra Shadow Tracker, Path Wolf Spider Varma, which I still think is a very late April Fool's joke by Hasbro, haha, <laughs> that I have done all days. Chuckles, Chuckles is coming on September the 1st which is good because the first we heard, it was announced that he was going to be dropped in November. But now we're getting him in September, so that's good. Hopefully Hasbro, you can do for the, the same thing for the SDCC uh, Starkiller and uh, Black Cassandra. If you can move them up to uh, September, that will be much appreciated. Um, yeah. Alright, so we've got all of this. I'm very, very happy to help the G.I. Joe community. Um, big shout out going to, uh, alright, Chaz the Guru, follow him on Instagram, he is the main man when it comes to G.I. Joe, there's a couple of other major Instagram accounts and I can't, I've got to try and remember everyone's names, alright, and I'm going to support you guys, and hopefully the YouTubers, I can feed you the figures, you don't have to, if you can get them from somewhere else earlier, that's your choice, alright. Um, MCU Collector, I just watched his um, latest unboxing of the Viper and Big Ben, absolutely brilliant, I love his channel, I love the style, okay, so <clears throat> I'm, I'm supporting the collectors and I'm supporting the, the social influencers on social media as well, so, um, but uh, yeah, the main, the main challenge as everybody knows is dealing with big corporations like... Uh, 
and other certain um, companies um, that we should not mention here. Um, so yes, I, I am recovering from my uh, the, the bubonic plague. I basically the last three days I've been lying on that couch over there. Queenie, don't touch that couch by the way. We need to just 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 incinerate it. It's disgusting. I didn't wash for three days. My whole body is covered in a rash. It's, it's gross. Um, um, I'm able to move my body around now, like a very decrepit 95 year old. Uh, I got the croaky voice of a, you know, of a, a cigar smoker, and uh, halitosis. My breath stinks, but you know it's all good. I'm, 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 I'm uh, you know. I'm uh, keeping up appearances. Um, what else have I got to say? I'm not going to talk about Star Wars in this video. I'm just going to keep it separate. G.I. Joe classified. Star Wars will be for another time. All right. Uh, let me see. Is there anything else that we need to mention? Oh, yes. In Taiwan, people, I don't know why, but people do not appreciate the, the retro card backs. Well, boo, boo, boo. To, you know, that's your loss and my gain. If you don't want these, then that's fine. I'll buy them up. I'm like Pac-Man. So those of you who are my overseas clients and you do appreciate the retro style G.I. Joes, then just ask me and I'll go and I'll find them for you. There are actually, there are some really nice sellers in Taiwan that I respect a lot. You know, we've got a little group of small independent sellers, retailers, and we all come together and we help each other. And that's the best way to go. And you guys need to support us. And I shall say this as well. And I've said this before to my Star Wars collectors. If you order from me and I give you a date and it's coming soon. But then like one week later you say you're rude to me and say give me a refund. Or you say I bought it from someone else. I want my money back. Now if you talk to me like that. You will be banned from my store. All right? Forever. Look, uh, I'm not an unreasonable person. I'm very fair minded and I care a lot about customer service. All right? But I also care about the behavior and the attitude of the customer. So I'm going to say this once and once only to the G.I. Joe collectors as well. Be nice, be respectful, be courteous. Okay? It's a two way street. I'm helping you scratch your back you got to scratch my back as well, okay? We're all in this together. And, uh, yeah, that's it.